Angela. I wrongfully accused my husband because I searched his luggage and I I find out something on his bosses. So I was, I was thinking it's a spam. You know, I, did, I never knew it was a soap actually. So because of that, he became so angry. So we had a little fight. So I, I felt bad, seriously. So I had to apologize to him. No, no, no. No, 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 no. You shouldn't have done that. Huh? Why? Do you know what? Yesterday I was on my way to Ubi Road. I actually met your husband. He gave me a lift. Yes. When he dropped me, he gave me some money and started telling me that he likes me. Hmm? Can you imagine? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> you mean my husband told you he likes you? Exactly. <laughs> no, no, no. Not my husband. My husband cannot do that. I know him too well. He's not happy with me. I'm serious about what I'm telling you. <laughs> Come on, Angela. It's not my husband. He can't do that. I trust him in that 100% he cannot. Just look at him. I'm telling you. So you think I'll leave my shop and come here to feed you with falsehood? What will I benefit from doing that? I'm telling you the truth. He did. What? Yes. Paul? <laughs> he did it. Men are very wicked. Paul. Paul. Why I want you to study hard and become a veterinary doctor is uh, because of the high rate of incompetence in the best of those you have. Because uh, uh, ninety percent of our vet doctors are so incompetent. You can imagine the level of incompetency we experience here in my farm. The chickens dying on the pigs, the goats, uh, gradually dying because there's no competent hand to administer drugs on them. So you know if you can come out in flying colors, you can now. Uh, Take over the, uh, the farm. You understand? You know, we are expanding. The more I build more farms, the more we have livestock, more livestock. And if we keep wasting them like this in the hands of incompetent vet doctors, it doesn't make any meaning. You understand? So you have to study hard. Right? Hey, hey brother, you know I'll be going to school tomorrow. So, there's so many things needed. He asked us to bring five crates of eggs, three live chickens, and so many things involved. So okay. I mean, I was expecting to hear five trailer loads of eggs. Yeah. Uh, that wouldn't be a problem. Five crates wouldn't be a problem. You know where to get it. Yeah. Right. And um, the chicken. You can always get it from the farm. All right, so. Is there any money needed? Yes, I'll be needing some money to get some apparatus for lab practicals. Okay, um, it's all right. All you need to do is um, just make your list. Okay, uh, brother. Make your list there now. Bring it to me. The money will be no problem. Brother, thank you. You are. Thank you. So, are we good now? Yes, brother. Yeah. Where is that smell coming from? Is anybody smoking in there helping this compound? I'm passing it too soon. <laughs> Juliet. <laughs> Sir? I think someone is smoking in there helping in the neighborhood. But that's why I'm here. I'm still perceiving it. And I think it's very, very close. The person is not our neighbor. The source is close by. In this compound? Yes, sir. Are you trying to say? The source is close by. Inside this compound. Someone smoking in my compound? Mm -hmm. Someone smoking in my compound? Let it not be Okoro. Because if it is Okoro, I will kill him. Maybe. If it is Okoro, I will kill him. Hey.
Junior bubble boy. Junior, Junior, do you want to eat? Yes, sir. You want to eat? Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <coughs> sorry, <coughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sir. sir. Huh? Um, your brain is too small. Huh? Um, I want to, by the time you will reach 13 years, you will be champion and win award like fella Wakuti. Hope you want that. It's okay. Sondo, don't fool my nose. Makara? Sir? What gave you the moral to smoke in my mouth? I'm not smoking. Shut up! You are not smoking as if I'm not perceiving it. Me too, I'm perceiving. You are perceiving what you're smoking and you're telling me you to... When did you start smoking? Me? You tell me! But I'm not smoking. I'm too small to smoke. Will you shut up? You are too small. Seven years ago, I employed you. You are like this. So you are still like this. Don't deceive yourself with your eyes. I don't think he's the one smoking. I can perceive it somewhere there. If I find out that you are the one smoking in my compound, you will lose your job. And you will not just lose your job, I will kill you. I hope you understand all the orientation that I'm giving to you. Yes. Oh. Yes. House. The most annoying part of it is that you gave it to my son to smoke. How could you? Uh, sister, I did not give Junior any weed to smoke. I don't know what you are talking about, please. What are you saying? That you don't know what I am talking about? Are you saying that my son is he is lying? Is that what you're saying? I I I I brought you all the way from the village to this place to become reasonable, to become responsible. But no. Or you go about this to smoke weed, as usual. You and I know that Junior is still a small boy. You don't have to believe what he told you. Eh? How can I give Junior weed to smoke? 
you are still lying to me. Because I know my son. You are still lying to me. Please, I beg you in the name of God, please. If you don't want to stay here, you can quietly pack your things and get back to the village. Since you don't want to become responsible. This will be the first and last you will do such a thing. Because I will not, I repeat, I will not tolerate this. Sister, I'm so sorry about it. It will not happen again, I'm so sorry. Please, let it not happen again because I will not. I repeat, I will not tolerate it anymore. Better use your brain. Better use your brain. Did you see the money I kept in my drawer? No. I did not. Then who took the hundred thousand that I kept in my drawer? I can't find it. Jesus. Jesus. Did you check your drawer very well? What do you mean? What do you mean? I checked everywhere, even, even at the back of the, the, the drawer. I couldn't find the money. How much? Who must have taken the money? Where did you keep the money in the first place? Do, do I look like a lunatic? Are you sure you searched very well? Because he might have mistakenly kept it somewhere else, apart from the drawer. Do you check very well? Chinedu, did you see my money? Wait, 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 wait. Are you implying that he stole your money? Woman, can you shut up? Can you just shut up? That was a question that I asked. But your question is pregnant with meaning. You're accusing him that he stole your money. If he didn't take my money, shut up. But dad, I saw Uncle Chinedu going to your room. But I didn't know what he went there to do. Praise. Mm -hmm. What was that? She's right. How can you lie against me? I'm not lying against you. Stop calling me a liar. My dad did not train me that way. Hmm? Chinedu, where is my hundred thousand naira? Brother did not see your money. Uncle, stop lying. Shut up, dear. Stop lying. Good. Huh? You did not see my money. No problem. Good. There shouldn't be any cause for alarm. 
let me assume that my ancestors had gone into my room and collected the money because I've not given them cola nut and drinks. But then go inside your room, pack your things and leave my house. This minute, I don't want to see you the next minute in my house. And don't forget I've got a gun. I know you too well. You know how close both of us are. Hmm? Tell me the truth. Did you steal his money? Sister, I have told you that I did not see any money. <laughs> I'm not a criminal. I'm a baby. I'm a money. Even at that. Eh? You don't give the back. You stole the money. You don't want to tell me. Even if you need money, you could have told me. I'm your sister. Hmm? I could have given it to you. She needs you. Sister. Mom needs you, Rega. Hmm? You like her? More here. Hmm? Sister, you know, she's a one more than an echo, Derico. I can't even Derico, go no gun. A promo, no, sister, I was no more there. Stop telling me that and I don't like it. Juliet, hmm. how is she faring now? She's getting better. Baby, sorry. Oh. She's not getting better, tell me, so I can take her to the hospital. That wouldn't be necessary. Let's just wait here. Oh. oh my baby! My baby, what, what happened to you? Oh. What happened to her? Where is that coming from? I want to know where that one is coming from! What kind of woman being are you? You're so wicked and insensitive! You're just coming back now and you're oh baby. Eh? The other day Juno took ill. You left him. You abandoned him for your sister. You abandoned him for your sister! Never mind if he was if he was going to die or not! Now praise is sick. You left praise for that stupid and useless god forsaken shop of yours! And you're coming back, oh my baby! Are you You're so stupid! What kind of woman are you? And what kind of man are you? Sandra! Hey, please excuse me. This is my family affairs. I don't want any children. It's your family affairs. Did you say that? Yes. It's your family affairs. Can you see the kind of friend you came? Can you? This stupid idiot standing right in front of me is the worst woman I've ever seen in my life. This woman standing right in front of me, this idiot, doesn't wash my clothes. She doesn't cook for me. She doesn't do anything in the house. If not for Juliet, her sister, I don't know what would have become of my children. If not for Juliet, we would have died of hunger. She cares about her shop. Every time it's a shop, shop, shop. She doesn't contribute nothing in this family. She doesn't. Yet to claim to be my wife. What manner of woman I swear to God I regret ever marry as my wife. I regret it. Every day then they fight. Do the rest. Woman will not get respect for your husband. Will not they care for your children self. Bad what? Oh please, please. Hello. See, look, Paul. All this you're ranting. All this you're shouting. They are flat as old woman's breasts. Really? Yes. You and I own this family. 
You cannot expect me to run your responsibility alone. You cannot. Never. Responsibilities. Responsibilities. Tell me, which part of the responsibilities have you been adding to? Tell me. You see, this idiot right here does not do anything. This idiot doesn't know why her children are hungry. Ask her, what did your children eat this morning? She doesn't know. What did I eat this morning? Do you know? She doesn't. She doesn't do anything. She doesn't know how to cook. She doesn't do virtually nothing. She can't even buy an ordinary toothpaste. This idiot standing right here. But when you met me, I was a slave. I was well to do. I was capable of myself. So don't, do not expect me to come into this family and suffer. Never. Will you expect me to come and suffer? How? Hello? No, tell me! You fool. A foolish man. You're not even a man. You're not even man enough. Go and see men that they're gonna have a sword. You've just ordinary small money. No, 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 no. Let me, let me, let me wash you down. Let me wash you down. You're not even a man. No, try it, you fool. You're a stupid man. Yes! Paul, you can see me. She said you're an idiot. Paul is an Paul is an idiot. 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 Excuse me. Idiot. Paul is an idiot. You are an idiot. You are an idiot. You are an idiot. Oh! Paul is an idiot. In my own house. Is my booty? Is my own hand? You are an idiot. You are an idiot. You are an idiot. Yes. Do you know what? Excuse me! You know what? You had better go and order for a phone. This will be your room. If I should see you there, I swear to God, I will kill you. Is that what you if want I don't kill you. No, you don't want to give me phone. I'm an idiot. Yes, that's no, what. Sit down. Sit. 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 I do virtually everything for my wife just to make her happy. But she doesn't give me peace of mind. If more for Juliet, my children and I would have died of hunger. <laughs> my wife doesn't cook for me. She doesn't wash my clothes. She doesn't even take care of the children. Oh, so you still have the mouth to talk? Yeah? You don't have any right to touch my sister, my own blood sister! Any man that beats a woman is an idiot! Tine, you keep quiet! Papa, let me keep quiet! This is the matter of shutting up! Boy, you didn't do well! Thank your God that I was not there! Tine, Tine! Mama, Mama, it's okay. Don't, don't, Tine, do me. I go call me also, let me be. No, 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 Tine, do tell me. Had it been you were there, what would you have done? Tell me! Boy! You would have seen the deepest part of me! I am not surprised because you have similar character with your sister. Nonsense. Papa, would you believe that when this Chinedu that is ranting here came to my house, that he was smoking in their in every part of the compound, this Chinedu, that he even gave to my son? Ibo? Yes! Rubbish. That, Ibo? As if that was not enough, he went into my bedroom, my inner room, and took the 100,000 that I kept in my drawer. Papa, guess what? My wife, his sister, supported him. That was the reason I asked him to leave my house. This thing I do here. Chine, do is that true? Mama, don't chine do me. Let me be. Don't try to ask me that. Anya. Idiot. Stupid boy. Nonsense. The truth is that. Senseless woman be. I came back here. Hey. Because of the respect I have for this family. I hold this very family in a very high esteem. If not, I wouldn't have come back here, Papa. I wouldn't have. Nonsense. Paul, we don't want you. Go to hell for all I care. Get out. Nonsense. You see that? Hey! My son, please. I am sorry. You are a good man. But it's a pity you ended up with a very bad woman. Eh? You see, it baffles me we are my daughter's behavior is coming from. I don't know where she borrowed this dirty behavior from. Eh? 
Please. I, raised I am that way. very, very I raised sorry. That way. Please. I don't know where she got eh? her character from. I don't know. I don't know. Because please, one. Paul. Please. I'm sorry. Eh? Eh? I'll be coming to the city to see you. Sorry. How are my kids? Brother, they are fine. Brother, please, return to your home. Everybody is missing. Please. You say, Juliet, you've seen me so much. Light in my back is part. Taking care of me and my children. You really sacrifice a lot. I don't know how to say that. I don't know what to say, but the truth is that. The truth is that I love you, Juliet. Hmm? So, sir? What gave Brother Paul that courage to tell me what he has just told me? I think that he was under the influence of ethanol. But he doesn't drink. No, he said that out of joke. Did you run at the side of me? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. Well, how are my kids? They are all fine, sir. What of Okoro? Okoro is fine, sir. Brother, please come back home. Your children need you. You're the reason I'm there. Please. They need someone to take care of them. Be for me. I will come back home to it. When? So. <sighs> okay. So where are you headed? I'm going to the market, sir. Yeah, so Juliet, why have you never bothered to come and see me? For the past three days, you don't even care about my well being. Brother, I'm sorry. Just that the last time I visited. You made me... Why are you scared of me? Hmm? What have I done? I'm scared. Brother, I don't think you understand what you really told me the last time I came to visit you. How could you tell me you had feelings for me? Brother, if you really want to take a second wife, it shouldn't be me. It shouldn't be you. There's a perspective. You may be right, but the big challenge here is that all these are line prostrate, and no one knows the one that's so fast from stomach ache. 
Come on, I don't know the, the next Jezebel I might fall into. I am out there. I don't know. Brother Paul, I'm still surprised you could tell me this. Have you forgotten I'm fully engaged to someone? Oh, God. It's all right. Come to the calendar job job today. To listen to you. You see anything that concerns Paul, I don't want to listen. Ha! Huh. But you don't know what I want to tell you. Whatever you want to say, keep it to yourself. You don't get it. I'm not in that mood now. Uh, what is it now? I don't want to listen. Since you've become my husband's spokesperson, please avoid me. Go on now. What is it now? your faces are like this. You want to beat me? <sighs> what is it? Mom, I want to sit down. Yes, Mom. He means Dad. Look, don't worry. Dad will soon be returning. But well, Mom, he said it yesterday. Ah. You see me now manufacture your father? Eh? Why is that I watch, watch your cartoon? I said, get out from here. Get out. Get out from here! Come, 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 get out. Publish. Huh? I want to see that. I want to see that. Oh, come and cut me the rest now. What 
Jessica, you're drunk. I'm not dumb. Uh, I'm just happy. Why are you doing this to yourself? Come. Huh? Come. Brother, please come back home. Please. I will come back. Just come to this home. Come. Brother. Come. Brother, please don't do this. Ah!